So we've all heard of that game called Just the Tip. This is Just the Tips. morning. Happy Monday. So one of the biggest questions or concerns, um, maybe a setback, um, roadblock, whatever you choose to describe it, but one of the most profound items that I find myself talking about with, with clients and, and in general, just, just people that are struggling to uh, reach their full potential when it comes to their training, their nutrition, their goals. And ultimately, it's pretty pretty applicable to other places in life. But, you know, I'm into fitness. Fitness coffee in my stomach. Anyway, Mondays are generally packed with stuff, right? Full schedules, appointments. Uh, running here, running there. If you've got kids, they've got practice and any number of things that are really important. But then there's those goals when they come to the gym. And it's very often like, well, I'd like to make it to the gym today, but I'm really busy. Noted. Now, I understand that. And I, I definitely don't... Um, I don't disagree that it's difficult, but I also don't disagree that there are certain items in your schedule in your life that are way more important um, than your fitness goals. I get it. There's certain things that are always going to take precedent. That being said, one of the easiest ways to make sure you're always prepared to go to the gym in the trunk of your car or your back seat, have a set of gym clothes in a bag with some shoes, ready to go. And uh, for shits and giggles, why not stick some uh, shower stuff in there just in case, right? So maybe you've got somewhere to go um, in the evening and you don't want to get sweaty and gross and, and then go. So you take your shower stuff with you, get a second set, put it in the car. That way you're always there. It's like having like... Um, uh, like a, a set of jumper cables in your car, right? Like, it's better to have it and not need it than need it and not have it. Um, so when it comes to your gym stuff, keep it in the car all the time. That way it's always there. And if you use it, well, clean your clothes, put it back in the car. Put that on your list of things to do. Now, second thing you can do is a bonus. Freebie. Make sure that the gym that you train most frequently, the gym, the gym at which you train most frequently, I should say. I'm trying to not have poor grammar. Make sure that gym is on your way home or close to it so you're not going far out of your way. It's going to take an excuse out of your book of like, oh, it's so far to the gym, traffic's bad, blah, blah, blah. Well, if you've got to drive by it anyway, you might as well stop. Um, you definitely, you know, try to not have it be the opposite direction of where you live. Sometimes that's unavoidable. I get that. Um, so yeah, that's your, your, uh, tip and your bonus tip. And you thought it was just the tip. There's two of them. Anyway, have a great month.